product cooking program today. Today we want to show you guys that, you know what I mean, tell you all a little bit and tips about Christmas. Christmas is coming up soon. Welcome back guys. As you can see, this morning I decided to make you some lovely Jamaican plantain porridge. It's going to be plain straightforward. But the only thing I did blend my plantain earlier, which I should show you guys, but you know what I mean? I have a lot of video on the YouTube channel show you how to blend plantain. Anyone can do that at home. So anyway, basically as you can see, I use one and a half of plantain, one and a half cups of all the milk, and I put it straight inside of my smoothie blender and blend it for roughly one nice good six to seven minutes until it come out really smooth and fine. But basically as you can see guys, plantain porridge is healthy, good for you and you can do this at home all you need to do is just remove the skin from the plantain and peel it cut it up very small put it inside of the your blender or a smoothie blender and blend it for seven or eight minutes with some milk all right so that's finished lovely and nice so now we're going to show you how to make this at home inside of your kitchen for your breakfast in the morning for your husband or for yourself for your boyfriend, for your partner, ready for who you want to make it for. But planting porridge is healthy and good. Enjoy the same. on my stove empty nothing inside of it clean and nice but basically I'm gonna show you the best way to make porridge at home in your kitchen first of all I'm gonna put two cups of boiling water nice one that's two cups of boiling water and that's the best way to make porridge at home. The reason why I said this is the best way because I did it like this before and it works really well for me. So I said to myself, let's share it with the fans. Hopefully they will love it. Um, as you can see that most Jamaican people do make porridge and when they make their porridge, they use coconut milk or coconut cream inside of it. So right here I have some coconut milk which I'm gonna pour straight inside of it. So I'm gonna pour roughly quarter cups of coconut milk inside of it that's the coconut milk then second thing if I get my plantain which I just blend up very finely and smoothly ready for only to cook what I'm gonna simply do because the water is hot which I put in is boiling water and I just add a little bit of coconut milk inside of it so now i'm gonna pour the blending of the plantain right into inside of it like this lovely and nice so give it a whisk but the beauty is that there's a little bit more left inside of the tub where you need to rinse out with a little bit of milk so guys remember just rinse out your smoothie and smoothie where you blend up your your plant in let's rinse out with a little bit of milk like this and pour inside of it like this guys lovely whisk it like this for roughly about five to six minutes until it get thick you're gonna get really thick so guys as you can see this is exactly what I'm talking about. Look at that. Really thick. When it's thick like this, it's easy to correct. But when it when it's running, you can't correct it. Look at that. Really thick. Nice and lovely. So when it's like that, what all I need to do is just to get my milk, my own milk, and simple. Add a little bit more to it like this. roughly 
half cups of milk. Keep whistling it. Oh man, look at that. Beautiful, beautiful guys. And I always say in my video, when you're making porridge, it's best to put less water inside of the pot. That's the key point. Second thing, if you're making calming porridge, that's the best way to do it also. Turning your stove a little bit more, guys. Don't make it, you know what I mean, boil and turn and boil up on your stove to dirt up your stove. But that's the best way. Put a little bit of water inside of the pot of the bottom and then you add your ingredients. You can always correct it that way. It's easier to correct and it is better for you. So look at that. Beautiful. This is this is a real Jamaican. Seriously guys, this is not this is not like a joke thing. This is a real Jamaican plant porridge. It, when you go to Jamaica and you go into the, the, the restaurant or a local shop around the corner or on the high street and you ask for a bowl of plant and porridge, this is where you would normally get. So leave this and make it cook for roughly one nice good 15 minutes because the plant need to cook, alright? So leave that for 15 minutes and you can do something in the meantime. Great tell you not the egg or you know what I mean? Get the rest of stuff them ready in the meantime. Enjoy the recipe guys. Nice and lovely guys. Just just take the moment. Just take a moment and look at this. Beautiful. Beautiful. Oh my days. Help me Lord. Help me. Help me. Help me. I don't know what I'm going on in this kitchen today. But anyway, it's plant porridge and it, it's beautiful. It's really good. Really, really good. Basically, we're gonna. This is roughly about 15 minutes now since I've been cooking it like this. Now we need to get it sweetened and tasted and you know what I mean get the flavor inside of it with cinnamon and spices. Um, so first of all, what I'm gonna simply do is put half teaspoon of salt inside of it. Lovely, half teaspoon of salt. Nice one. Give it a stir. Sometimes you can season it before you start even put other S, but you know what I mean. I like it this way. Then, Half teaspoon of grounded nutmeg egg right here. Get in, get in, get in. This is a grated nutmeg egg, and I'm using half teaspoon of it inside of it just to get in the flavor and the taste of everything in it. Pinch of cinnamon. Cinnamon is strong, so you have to be careful of the cinnamon. Very strong. That's the cinnamon. Love. Because cinnamon is strong, so you have to be careful of cinnamon. Then, vanilla. Teaspoon of vanilla. Mmm. Love scent of vanilla. Vanilla smells so nice. Oh, the vanilla scent, man, really nice. Then we got some sweet condensed milk we're gonna use inside of it, guys. The only thing I wanna simply say to you, with the sweet condensed milk, you need to sweeten and taste as it goes along. Please, just don't only just chucking things. You know what I mean? Sweeten and taste as it goes along. So now we're gonna, I'm gonna start to add some sweet condensed milk inside of it like this and I'm gonna use roughly about half cans of the sweet condensed milk and then I'm gonna taste it and see how it tastes after all right oh my god look at that beautiful oh oh my lord in heaven help someone this morning help someone help we need some help here look at this beautiful look at it a lot of people don't like plant porridge, but honestly, this is natural. Seriously, natural. This is an artificial thing. This is just natural. And the ingredients of plant porridge do work really well for men and the ladies also. So, 
Anyway, give it a taste and see exactly what we are about now. Mm. Oh my Jesus. Oh, God help me. Chef Ricardo, come on. This tastes amazing where you are. I don't know where you are at the moment. But I'm telling you, if it's this a work, would I? And you need a bowl of porridge, I could just bring it, come give it, make a taste this one. This is brilliant. Beautiful, nice, tasty, everything you can think of. Plant porridge is the best of the best in the world. I love my plant porridge. I've been drinking this for years, honestly. Back a um, couple of months ago, I used to make plant porridge every weekend. Plant with oats, plant with this, plant with banana. Planted with caramel. So basically, leave this make it cook for another five or six more minutes. Then we're gonna share it out. All right, lovely one. Enjoy the recipe, guys. Oh yes, this is finished, done and dusted, guys. As I can see, exactly where Chef Ricardo is all about with this plant part this morning. So hopefully, you guys, will like the recipe. Subscribe to the channel. Please leave your comments. Now we're gonna pour it out in a big bowl. I'm making sure you all Jamaican make the real caramel porridge. Enjoy the recipe. Plant porridge, sorry guys. The real plant porridge. Nice and lovely. So as you can see, I'm already set my table with some green planting. I got some crackers, piece of cinnamon, spoon, and a big ball. Pour them out, not a big ball like this. Ah, look at that. Beautiful. So, this is exactly what Chef Ricardo is all about with the plant porridge in the morning for breakfast. When you drink something like this in the morning, honestly, guys, you don't need to eat anything for the rest of the day. That does keep you straight through the day. You don't need a chicken, you don't need no beef, you don't need no, no steak or no lamb or nothing. When you drink a bowl of a porridge like that in the morning for your breakfast, that where you stay strong, fit, healthy. <laughs> And that do dangerous job so guys enjoy the recipe subscribe to the channel and leave your comments and this one is from chef ricardo this morning for your breakfast you can use it anytime for your breakfast in the morning plant and porridge from jamaica enjoy it see you next time Bye -bye. Thank you so much and hopefully you have a wonderful time. Enjoy yourself and see you in the next time.